Okay, sweet. So what we'll do, this is our Soviet apartment. Mm -hmm. So if we come down the corridor, we have the bathroom. Okay. Yeah, we do. So standard sort of Russian bathroom. Yep. I love all the exposed pipes and stuff. Yeah, that's the thing. I honestly don't know much about the plumbing and stuff like that, but I mean, these places were built in the 1950s and mm -hmm. I think they were built for sort of minimal sort of attention to detail. So it's yeah. the whole thing of everyone had the basic sort of plumbing. And as people sort of progress, they've actually added things as time comes on. Yeah. So you have your basic sink here, mm -hmm. your gas stove. Yeah. And those the gas stoves are quite a thing. Yep. Um, they're little places. Well, I mean, apparently it was a big thing in the 1950s when they put in the gas lines. It was seen mm. as, hey, we're modern. Um, yeah, because this is just, how were these apartments named? They were Khrushchev apartments or something Yeah, like Khrushchev that. apartments. Yeah, I just so that. So the fact is, in the 1950s and 60s, mm -hmm. you had the different sort of apartments. Yeah. And the wallpaper was pretty... <laughs> it's it freaking been amazing. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. But, I mean, you have the different areas as well. I mean, mm. you have your standard sort of furniture, like everyone had the standard like, yep. chairs, mm -hmm. standard tables as well. Yeah. Um, but I mean, you even have little, never actually looked at nooks and crannies, but. They're everywhere, holy right? Holy crap. What is that? It looks like a radio. Whoa. Oh my, the, hey, that could be the radio. You know how the radio on the wall with the, ra the. Russia Channel? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah, because I've seen one at Naz's house. Yeah. That was actually stuck in the wall still, though. Yeah. And you should thing. totally pull it out. Because it, it still broadcasts. Yeah, well, that's the thing. It's the whole sort of, you know, you have your different sort of, like, Russians love their big mirrors as well, because mm -hmm. the whole thing of before you go out, you check yourself, mm -hmm. do you hear? Well, this is why I'll never be Russian. <laughs> um, your wardrobe, before we put some things. Yeah. What a nice stuff the sort of main living area, so you have, like, the sort of, Dining area, slant lounge area, mm -hmm. slant main bedroom as well. Yeah. Um, and you can see this is when they had a partition, like they used to have curtains, so you would have had like the dining area, slant yep. sort of lounge area. You've got like the old china cabinet display, mm -hmm. all that. Hey, look, we got this plate. No, I, I like plate. that you're making such good use of the china cabinet, by the way. Yeah, it's <laughs> one of those things. It's like, mm, okay, I mean, it's good for stashing like here. Just random stuff, yeah. Random stuff outside mm -hmm. our minds. To close yeah. the thing as well. Well, I mean, I've heard as well that used to be, because I mean, there's a couple yeah. of power points and things here, but I've heard there used to be one power outlet per apartment as well. That would surprise me because looking at the power outlets, if you look at some of the wiring, you can see how they've put a new wiring over the years as well. So here's a classic yeah. example here. Mm -hmm. um, and you have, like, for example. Oh, there's another little cupboard. Yeah. I've never seen that one before. There's a lot of They are freaking cupboards. everywhere. So you look at all this random stuff which been put Is that away. like fertilizer? God knows. <laughs> There's random stuff which has been stashed away and I'm just looking at I I mean that looks like a copy of Pravda or whatever, but there's stuff which has been stashed away over the years. I mm -hmm. mean and it's like I've looked around, like you got the old blankets. Oh I like that the uh, cupboard's actually falling out of <laughs> Oh, I got a snow shovel as well. What? Yeah, I did not know that was there. Well, how much shoveling of snow would you have done had you known? Well, that's the thing, because it's like, that's actually pretty new as well. So yeah. It's like, no, well, the thing is that it's you full of it. gold. I'm worried about that. All right, it's going to say that. Cool. Yep, so it's not going to fall apart. Mm -hmm. I mean, but you have the old sort of standard issue of Soviet furniture. Um, yeah. Common feature of these apartments, of course, is the radiators. Yeah. Actually, I've seen these in... Actually, these are still in the schools, and these are the kind yeah. of radiators at a university as well. Mm. Um, they do the job. Actually, they're in England too. Yeah. Like, exactly the same ones. Got the, the most windows, bleak I mean. outlook ever. Well, I mean, that's why I miss the snow, because the fact is outside it would be nice and, you know, it would be covered in white and actually look really pretty, whereas yeah. now it's shitty. Yeah, <laughs> just a bit, yeah. I mean... And saying so that you have the old ladies which will tend to the gardens and mm -hmm. they will actually plant something there, but. Okay. Yeah, and the thing I know about the different apartments is that you the doors, there's sort of like no privacy, so you've got the yeah. glass doors, so you mm -hmm. know what everyone's up to. Yeah. I'm curious to see whether they, my landlord's place we bought in his spare furniture, because you have this separate dining table here, mm -hmm. two beds here, so I'm guessing that back in the day this would have been like a study area mm -hmm. for the kids. Kids' bedroom. Yeah. And I mean, it's interesting you made a comment about the PowerPoints. You can see where they've hacked in different holes. Yeah, hang on. Let's have a look at that. Because that's 
pretty great actually. Yeah. I remember this when I was staying here. It's just there actually all the power points pretty much in here are falling out of the walls. That's the thing, and it's the whole mm. thing of I think a lot of this stuff they've sort of chucked in willy nilly. I mean Yeah. This one's probably alright, but if you look at the lamp here, if you look at the wiring. You know, basically drill a hole, just bung something in. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I've got this like the slowest zoom in the world on my camera. Alright, cool. Yeah. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah. I'm gonna say, I think probably the, my favourite thing about your apartment, other than the wallpaper, is the fridge. Like the really, really old fridge. Yep. It's so cool. Oh, I mean, this old school one. Mm hmm. That's the thing. It's like, it doesn't work, but it's the whole thing of this is what it would have been like. Yeah, exactly. And it's the whole thing. It reminds me of something which they made in the 1930s, but. Mm hmm. But a lot more modern. It's, it's more, more like a cool box, really, yeah, than a fridge. Yeah, and it's the thing which, I mean, you talk to a lot of the old school Russians which talk about the good old days of Soviet Union, they talk about we well, made this stuff and it lasted yeah. years and years mm -hmm. and it never broke down, whereas now... Except for the larder. <laughs> the larder's still being made but it's uh, breaks. Well, I've had people talk to me, or I've had people defend the larder and it's like... Yeah. I love it. I've said it before in videos that I love it. Yeah. Yeah. Um, it's interesting because you've got this sort of like, again, the different sort of veneers. Mm. Which are quite nice as well. Yeah. I mean, I like a wardrobe like this you'd obviously see in the West. Yeah. But, um, I don't know. It's, it's a very authentic pretty... feeling apartment. Yeah, and I mean, you've got the wooden floor as well, which, I mean, effectively it's just basically wooden tiles which mm -hmm. together. Yeah. I've always wondered, you know, why the landlord hasn't actually put on a new cover of varnish. Like, if you polish it up mm. and make a really, get like a really good sort of varnish. Yeah. This would be really great. Yeah. I mean, I mean, it's like you're saying, a lot of the people in these apartments are now renovating them and... If you go out to the rubber skip, you see that, you see a lot of these old doors, so what people are doing there is, I mean, upstairs, typical example, mm -hmm. they'll take out the walls, they'll chuck in, they'll place in new doors as well. Mm -hmm. New furniture, so you see a lot of these old school beds, which are pretty much, like, if you look at the bed here, the headboard, but the mattress, it's pretty much nothing to, it's just a standard sort of old school... Yeah. Like part of a couch cushion. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And that's the thing. It's a couch cushion and people would have made it into a couch. I've heard that some of the really, really sort of Soviet apartments used to have their whole fold away bed, so you basically fold it into a wardrobe. Yeah, which I still think is cool. It makes me think about cartoons where people accidentally get stuck in them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. And that's what I'm thinking as well. So they had that whole thing of actually preserving space. Mm -hmm. And this corner piece here, I mean... I have to keep on adjusting it because you sit in the corner, you basically fall through it. <laughs> yeah, did see you do that earlier today. But you had the different oh, things. Oh, hello, space. Yeah. So you Check have out space. the iron. Yes, this is the old school Russian iron. Yeah. So. It's very. It looks like a very serious weapon. Oh, look, this is actually genuine sort of made in the USSR. Oh, hello. Yeah, wow. You know, it looks exactly like the iron piece in Monopoly. <laughs> It does. In fact, it's, it's like you could do white training for it because it does. You could kill somebody.